North Korea is inspecting an operational arrangement to dispatch a ballistic rocket assault on the U.S. Air Force's Anderson Air Base in Guam, following President Trump's fire and rage risk on Tuesday. The Korean Central News Agency, KCNA, conveyed an announcement from the Korean People's Army, KPA, Wednesday, saying the military was painstakingly looking at the operational arrangement for making a wrapping fire at the ranges around Guam. U.S. vital planes get on the nerves of the DPRK with their regular visits to the sky above South Korea. Preemptive strike is never again the restraining infrastructure of the U.S., said the KPA proclamation. U.S. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson has guarded Trump's remarks that North Korea will be met with flame, rage and honestly control, any semblance of which the world has never observed, by saying the president just made a solid discretionary message for the ears of Kim Jong-un, and that there is no danger exuding from either side. The U.S. Pacific Command affirmed Tuesday that U.S. B-1B planes flew over the Korean promontory on Monday. North Korea considers preemptive strike on Guam. Preemptive strike is no longer the monopoly of the U.S. August 9, 2017 Edmund Ober News, World 1. North Korea. North Korea is analyzing an operational arrangement to dispatch a ballistic rocket assault on the U.S. Air Force's Anderson Air Base in Guam, following President Trump's fire and anger danger on Tuesday. The Korean Central News Agency, KCNA, conveyed an announcement from the Korean People's Army, KPA, Wednesday, saying the military was deliberately inspecting the operational arrangement for making a wrapping fire at the territories around Guam. U.S. key planes get on the nerves of the DPRK with their continuous visits to the sky above South Korea. Preemptive strike is not anymore the restraining infrastructure of the U.S said the KPA explanation. U.S. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson has protected Trump's remarks that North Korea will be met with flame, rage and honestly control, any semblance of which the world has never observed, by saying the president just made a solid political message for the ears of Kim Jong-un, and that there is no danger exuding from either side. Related, Trump threatens North Korea with flame and fury. The U.S. Pacific Command affirmed Tuesday that U.S. B-1B aircraft flew over the Korean landmass on Monday. View picture on Twitter View picture on Twitter View picture on Twitter. Take after. Pakaf at Pakaf. South Dakota hash airmen land on Guam, direct hash bilateral missions with Japan and Rock, U.S. prepared to hash fight on iBit Donlai web link. 1.21 a.m. August 9, 2017. 309 replies, 3,214 retweets, 3,812 preferences. Twitter adds information and protection. Advertisements by Rev Content. Related, Trump praises North Korean leader Kim Jong un for being a dictator. NK News reports. The arrangement, the points of interest of which were apparently laid out yesterday is in light of the U.S.'s test dispatch last Wednesday of the Minuteman 3 intercontinental ballistic rocket ICBM, from California's Vandenberg Air Force Base and of the current landing of six B-1B Lancers at the Anderson Air Force Base in Guam. Guam is a U.S. domain and home to a few American Army installations. The U.S. flew B-1B aircraft over the Korean landmass on 30 July in a reaction to North Korea's second trial of the Hwasong-14 ICBM, and again yesterday, as indicated by the KPA proclamation. The strategic force of the KPA has taken extraordinary note of such moves, the announcement peruses. The KPA strategic force is presently precisely analyzing the operational arrangement for making an encompassing flame at the territories around Guam with medium to long go key ballistic rocket Hwasong 12, keeping in mind the end goal to contain the U.S. real army installations on Guam. The announcement said that U.S. vital planes get on the nerves of the DPRK with their successive visits to the sky above South Korea. The arrangement will be will be tried in a multi-simultaneous and successive path on the request of Kim Jong-un, it included. The U.S. ought to unmistakably confront up to the way that the ballistic rockets of the strategic force of the KPA are currently on consistent standby, 
confronting the Pacific Ocean and give careful consideration to their azimuth plot for dispatch. In a different articulation likewise discharged on Wednesday, the General Staff of the Korean People's Army KPA, censured lay discuss military activity against North Korea from policymakers in the U.S. A military intercession against the DPRK would be met with a quite recently hard and fast war, the announcement stated, which would look to crush the fortresses of the foes including the U.S. terrain. The armed force of the DPRK will turn the U.S. territory into the performance center of an atomic war before the sacred place that is known for the DPRK transforms into the one, the announcement included. The KPA likewise said that a U.S. preemptive strike against North Korea rocket and atomic targets would be barbarously repulsed by the DPRK military, and would prompt a local clash. Preemptive strike is never again the restraining infrastructure of the U.S. The KPA stated, saying that they would consume all U.S. military resources in the zone, counting Seoul. Referencing late remarks by Senator Lindsey Graham, and additionally Secretary of Defense James Mattis and Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff James Dunford, the KPA guaranteed a preemptive retaliatory operation of equity on the off chance that it saw even a slight sign of a U.S. decapitating operation against North Korea's administration. Once the U.S. hints at a beginning to do the audacious plot, we will dispatch the Korean-style preemptive retaliatory operation of equity to destroy the driving forces of the thrice-reviled operation and every one of the offenders engaged with it, the announcement peruses. The U.S. will be compelled to languish a possibly awful catastrophe over the decapitation operation. The announcement likewise assaulted an asserted U.S. plot to incite administration change and social change in the North, saying that U.S. was empowering kill, torching, devastation with the utilization of maverick-like unique commandos to be invaded into the DPRK. The mystery operation touted by the U.S. arrangement producers is a stupid plan went for cutting down the social arrangement of the DPRK, it included. The remarks by North Korea's military come hours after U.S. President Donald Trump guaranteed fire and fierceness against the DPRK should it keep on threatening the United States. Kim Jong-un, has been extremely debilitating. And I said they will be met with flame, fierceness and honestly control, any semblance of which this world has never observed, Trump said.